I'm here today to um, give an introduction, a little bit of training on an exciting new dye product. And, and what that dye product is, is it's called the HCG Enhancer. Um, comes in a, in a one, one ounce brown bottle, glass bottle like this. And um, what it's going to be used for is it's actually used as a means to um, either amplify the effects you're currently getting from your HCG diet regimen, whether it's drops or injections. Um, and it's also it could be used as a substitute for those HCG drops or injections. Um, some people have um, different opinions on, on the HCG diet and, and the drops and the injections themselves and are looking for a safe, natural alternative. Um, and again, this can be used as a substitute uh, for those drops or injections, or can be used as a complement to really maximize that diet um, and, and that program um, as you're on it, because you want to get the, the most results from that diet as you can in, a, in the shortest period of time. So jumping right in, is there, there's three key components within the HCG enhancer that are going to amplify the effects um, of the diet. And what those three key ingredients are, are, are velvet antler extract. And, and velvet antler extract is, is very nutrient rich in IGF-1. I'm sure if you've watched the other trainings, uh, you know that, again, velvet antler is uh, rich in IGF-1. IGF-1 is the, the end result of HGH produced in the body. And what IGF-1 is going to do is it's going to play a couple different roles in supporting weight loss. And what those are, are actually by uh, mobilizing proteins, fats, and sugars and converting them into energy much more efficiently. So it's going to naturally enhance your metabolism. It's going to speed and kick up your metabolism naturally. Um, IGF-1 is actually the only thing clinically proven, IGF-1 and HGH are the only thing clinically proven to uh, burn fat without any change in your diet or exercise regimen whatsoever. Also, the IGF-1 and velvet antler builds lean muscle mass. What lean muscle mass is going to do for your body is it's going to speed your metabolism up. And what I mean by that is for every pound of lean muscle mass you put on, you're going to burn an extra 30 to 50 calories a day. So if you put on 5 extra pounds of lean muscle, um, you can burn almost an extra 250 calories a day without changing your diet without changing your workout regimen whatsoever. Um, also, IGF-1 has a profound ability uh, to regulate or balance cortisol levels. And cortisol levels are, or cortisol is that stress hormone um, that causes you to retain belly fat when it's out of balance. So it's very important to keep uh, cortisol levels in a proper balance. Um, once they're in a proper balance, your blood sugar is gonna stay in a proper balance. Um, also, that, again, you're not going to have that retention of belly fat um, around your midsection, and that's going to cause that to be within a keep that cortisol in a in a balanced manner. Um, IGF-1 and velvet antler also balance hormones. They balance hormones during that very low calorie diet, um, as we've seen um, with uh, people that go on the very low calorie diets their hormones can go out of balance. And what that causes um, is it causes your body to go into protection mode because it sees that you're uh, essentially in a starvation mode. And, and essentially your body is just trying to protect yourself. It's trying to keep you alive. So when, you're, when you go and you go on that low calorie diet, whether it's 500 calories a day or 1,000 or 1,200 calories a day, um, your body sees it as it's starving. Um, so what it's gonna tell your, your, your body to do is retain weight. Um, because it's just trying to protect you, it's just trying to keep you alive. So while you're on these very low calorie diets, it's essential to keep your hormone balance, um, or keep your hormones in balance. Um, and if you don't keep your hormones in balance, it's going to really inhibit your fat loss and retard the, the weight loss that you're going to get during that diet regimen. Um, and that's something that the HCG does, and that's something that this product does on its own. Um, so it can either add added support to that hormone balancing uh, with the, to the HCG drops, or it can act uh, as a replacement for those drops or injections. Jumping into the next key ingredient, a uh, Chá de Bougre. It's a, it's a Portuguese word. Um, it's phonetically spelled out here, Chá de Bougre. Um, what 
Shada Bugre is, is it's from Brazil, from the Amazon basin. It's been used for centuries within their culture. Um, it's very similar to a coffee bean. They brew it in large barrels uh, during festivals. Um, and what it's used for is to give the individual sustained energy and heightened sense of energy um, throughout the night because they have these festivals where they celebrate all night. Um, and they actually brew this in large barrels and, and drink it throughout the festivals to keep it going. Um, currently, we have the strongest extract in the industry as a 10 to 1 extract of Shot of Bougre. And Shot of Bougre uh, has a couple of different functions when assisting in weight loss. Uh, one of which is reduces cellulite um, in the body. Uh, another one is it's actually going to give you sustained or increased energy throughout the day. When you go on these low calorie diets, um, calories are energy for your body and fuel for your body to get going. And when you're on a low calorie diet, your energy levels can be very, very low. Um, so getting clean energy, not jittery caffeine energy, um, it's not going to give uh, you know that type of stimulant energy where it's going to cause you to, to spike and to crash. It's going to give a nice, clean, sustained energy, and it's safe to use um, for people that have cardiac or heart issues. This is a safe energy stimulant for them to use because it's very, very mild, and again, it's a sustained, calm energy. Um, also, the Shot of Bougre is a powerful appetite suppressant. It suppresses your appetite. And not in the same means that other appetite suppressants do where they cause your, your appetite to basically cease and then once the herb or the tonic wears off, your an intense hunger comes back to you. What this is gonna do is it's gonna trick your brain into feeling satisfied or give your brain a feeling of satiety. Um, so it's gonna promote you to eat smaller meals frequently throughout the day. And of course, as you've seen with a lot of diets, they're promoting that as the best means to lose weight loss. It's better to eat smaller meals frequently throughout the day and to keep your metabolism um, steady and moving uh, in a very efficient manner throughout the day. So it's gonna promote your body to eat smaller meals and make you feel more satisfied after you eat those smaller meals. And if you're on a low calorie diet, uh, all your meals are going to be much smaller and this is going to give you uh, a great feeling of, of being satisfied after you adjust your diet and start eating those smaller portion meals. The last ingredient in this is methicobalin B12. I'm sure a lot of people know about B12. They know about the, uh, the ability for B12 to enhance weight loss. A lot of clinics do B12 injections to uh, help stimulate weight loss. A lot of them do it also with the HCG diet. Um, to also enhance the weight loss during that regimen. Um, but the, the type of B12 we're using is a special type of B12. There's two types of B12 you're going to see. You're going to see cyanocobalin, which is, uh, begins with the C, and you're going to see methicobalin. Cyanocobalin is far less bioactive or less active in the body than methicobalin. Um, methicobalin is essentially like a metabolite of, of the B12, and it's um, very efficiently absorbed and utilized within the body. Um, so it's far, far more effective than cyanocobalin, and as uh, because it's far more effective, it's actually far more expensive um, to manufacture than that traditional cyanocobalin. And if you're in health food stores, um, you start looking at B12 supplements, 98% of them are cyanocobalin B12 because it's far cheaper to use, um, but it's a far less effective form of B12 than the methicobalin. Um, and this methicobalin is also the type of B12 that they use in injections and in pharmaceuticals. So it is a pharmaceutical grade uh, form of B12. And, and B12 is gonna help out with energy levels. Um, it's also gonna help out with mobilizing proteins as, en uh, as energy. Um, it's gonna help out with your nervous system. There's a whole host of other functions, your blood cells, your red blood cells especially. So there's a whole host of other functions that B12 it's going to have, and especially this very bioactive form of B12. So um, what we have is what this complex is called, is it's called an aptamine complex, and that's for our proprietary complex and blend um, of these three powerful weight loss ingredients. Um, so what we've done is we've combined this proprietary blend, and we've trademarked it as the name aptamine um, because it suppresses the appetite and causes your body to, to naturally lean up. Um, so again, if people are looking to either maximize the effects that they're going to get from the HCG diet drop regimen or injection regimen, um, or they're just looking for an alternative because they've heard some controversy, whether on a, you know Dr. Oz or, or Oprah, 
um, and they've heard some conflicting evidence or information about that HCG diet, um, they can use this as an alternative 